the conversion is done by all in the cables, which is pretty interesting. So I've seen two different versions of this solution for the lack of a control port on a 3DO, but the 3DO pad soldier, all up in your world. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Interesting thing about that is I actually got it bundled with this game. So 15 bucks for the game, 15 bucks for the controller. Not a bad deal. Some would say a steal. Free shipping straight from Japan. So we got. Actually got a $20 Sega Nomad, which I was pretty pumped about. Um, this particular one, I haven't been able to test it out. I know that it works. Well, I trust the seller. I know that I, I believe that it works. Um, I don't have the right uh, AC adapter. Uh, to get this up and going and from my understanding it has a bit of a sound issue uh, there's like some feedback in the background but I think that's a capacitor issue so I should be able to solder a new capacitor on there and we'll have ourselves a 20 buck Nomad so toilet gaming will be taken to the next level because we'll be able to play any Sega Genesis game on the can that I want to which we all know how that is that we don't I was so excited, so very excited to find this game at uh, VG Castle, Video Game Castle in Chicopee. Uh, it's the PlayStation uh, PlayStation One version of Street Fighter Zero Three, or yeah, Street Fighter Zero Three. Um, I didn't even know that I wanted this game even until my brother mentioned it. He said that, um, well, I mean, I knew that the the PlayStation ports of Capcom fighting games were typically pretty pretty garbage. But he said that they came up with a wacky way to get this one to run uh, by the way that they they um, they handled the hitboxes in the game engine. And I guess they used vectors or poly polygon um, overlaid hitboxes that the game was keeping track of instead of the two-dimensional sprite boxes uh, that normal hitboxes would utilize. So I guess due to that, that quirky bit of programming, they were able to get this game to function more or less as it should on a PlayStation, so looking forward to popping that into my JPS2 and going to town with it, so there you have it, that's all I've got to show. Pickup video for BFG 69Gs.